and we're back. And it appears the sun is rising now. At least that's what it looks like. It's getting really orange and uh, red out there. I don't know if you could tell the difference. Um, basically, what I did while I was waiting, um, I just copy and pasted my this Minecraft save, and I loaded the vanilla mod pack in um, the Technic launcher. So I don't know if it, there's less lag. There's a uh, Seems like there's less block lag, there's still a little bit of mob lag, maybe that's just the problem with the version. But that never happens to me in Hexit, so I don't know what's going on. So yep, it's definitely becoming daytime now. Okay, I just saw a mob burn. I don't know if this Enderman is aggro at me, okay there's two of them. I had to kill one of them uh, over the night, my little trap that I set up here. Oh, and I just looked at him too. I hope they're just teleporting because it's day. Alright, run, run, run! Skeleton, why aren't you burning? Then the ones inside are burning. That makes no sense at all. Whew, that's a lot of spiders. These guys are like snipers, so there's no point in trying to, uh... Like, look at this. Alright, we're here to be safe. Except for that skeleton over there and those three spiders, but they're... They're neutral during the day, so that's good. Alright, so I'm just gonna drop some of this off here. These railings, these ladders, I don't need that much. Um, Gunpowder, flint, we don't need these. Apologize for my dog barking. I haven't quite figured out what's wrong with him. He just likes to bark nonstop. He gets really annoying. Actually, let's take those back. Alright, so let's try and grow a tree here at least. Then we'll convert this to a farm after. This guy's making me nervous, so I'm just gonna go preemptive strike on him. Really? Uh, we'll turn all these in the bone meal for now. There we go. Perfect. Um. <clears throat> I, since it is, I'm using the Technic Launcher, I tried to install my, uh, what's it called, the Shift Mod, but it doesn't work. I think I need to add Forge Loader in there. Then the other mod I tried adding into this was the Mob Decapitation Mod, or Amputation Mod, I think it's called, uh, which you may have seen in my Hexit series, uh, where their heads pop off and their limbs pop off, which I think is pretty cool. Um, and there's also a little bit of blood graphics when you get hit and stuff, so. Uh, I was trying to add that mod, but like I said, I think I need Forge Loader or Chicken Core. I don't know which, uh, I don't know which one, so I'd have to mess around with that later. Yay, stack of wood. It's an odd looking hoe, if I do say so myself. It's like a wand, or like a club or something. 
Okay, I had to take all my seeds. Let's make a little starter farm here. Nothing too fancy yet. In the future, uh, I am going to add some goals of my own. This is not just going to be a once and done playthrough. I'm going to, uh, oh, there's some block lag. Yep, it's back. I'm going to uh, try and play this map to uh, the maximum potential, I guess you could say. Put the carrot there. Okay. So as I was saying, I uh, <clears throat> I want to play this map uh, for the most I can, basically. So even after I complete the victory monument, I want to build some nice houses, and I hope to do that during my adventure here too. Um, build some nice houses and different areas that I find to be cool. Like I said, the only spoilers I really have of this map are the screenshots um, that they show you when you download the map. Uh, I should really use more stone. Okay. So those are really the only spoilers I've seen of this map. So I really hope to... Block lag. Really hope to have a... Have a good adventure here. Done. Are you done giving me block lag? I guess not. Hmm. One more dirt block would have done it. <clears throat> Ooh, even some apples from here. That'll help. Paranoid, I'm going to lose this stuff. Let's make a furnace. In case we ever need to cook anything. Okay. Let's see what we can make. Oh, man. There, we got a bow. Is that really one more block of dirt? I knew one more block would do it. Should have really made a fishing rod first. Didn't really think that through. Oh well. Don't need those. Keep the arrows, I guess. Uh, let's make a double chest. Good. Oh my god, Enderman, go bother someone else, alright? Go bother someone else. I don't want to mess with you right now. Or, like, ever.
Okay. Uh, let's before we go, let's plant some more trees. I don't have any more bone meal, so that's gonna suck. Uh, I'm gonna stick to using oak saplings for now, just because they drop apples, which is good. Which is what I need. enough. Oop, don't want to trample my crops here. So, I didn't even look at that enderman, but alright, I'm going to get in the water. <laughs> Let's go for a swim while I talk. Um, I'm going to check at the top of this waterfall to see if anything's up there. Then after that we'll go up this uh, staircase looking thing there to get up there. Let's see what we can find. Oh, jeez. What the heck? That's weird. Oh boy, oh boy. Go away. Go away. Oh, don't tell me the sun's starting to set, that's why. It's a little dark here. It's gonna light it up a bit. Duh, oh, yeah, there may be a pathway up here. My hunch was correct. Like a water pathway. Alright, I'll we'll check that out in a second. Just want to light this up so when I leave here I don't get mobbed or swarmed. Maybe something up there too. Check that out. Doesn't look like anything's over there though. Alright, uh, I'm gonna light this area up a little bit. Alright, let's go check what's in there. gravel on the bottom of this lake. If that's what you would call it. Looks pretty empty in this room. Thought I would see like a chest in here or something. Some goodies. Guess not. Kinda just like for sure for show. <laughs> Felt weird if I would say that first like for show. This place is just for show. Hmm. This gravel looks suspicious. Let's update it. Maybe it'll fall and reveal a chest or something. So far, I'm not seeing anything. Nope. Nothing. Alright. Waste of adventure. Oh, wait. Is there some up here? Oh, yeah. There's a cave up here. Oh boy. Almost completely missed it too. Oh lag, I knew that. Oh man, there's definitely a spawner up there. Oh the vines. They get in the way sometimes. Oh yeah, there's a spawner. Haha, -ha, I found you. Good night. There we go. Should be alright now. Ah, uh, another one. I see. Oh, did I see another one here, or was that just a torch? Goodbye. 
careful. Stone tools and food, low. I guess the low means like the level of what you're getting, maybe? Not sure. I guess this was before food stacked, maybe, or maybe just put that in there like that. Mushroom stew, that'll help though. Yeah, I was wondering what that glowstone dust was. It looked like sulfur from like uh, Technic or one of the Technic, I mean, one of those mod packs. I guess we'll eat this bread now. And we got 13 levels, so we can enchant this new stone sword we got. Which is nice. Very nice of Vex to give us things for once. You don't know who Vex is, he also has a YouTube channel. Pretty cool to check him out too, because he, uh, he's the maker of, uh, the super hostile, uh, super hostile map series. You're not the only archer here, skeleton. Oh, dirty. Oh, jeez. Huh. Huh. Got half the town after me. Well, I guess it's time to go then. Oh boy. I'm gonna have to fight. Oh jeez. Oh man. Huh. I I think Vex planned this. Huh. For you to get swarmed next time you came through here again at night. Alright, sprint! Uh, gotta get out of here. Oh boy. I'll fix it later. <laughs> Uh, couldn't even bank my stuff. Oh, the spider can still get through, though. Well, looks like I'm gonna have to wait till morning again. Hey, can't hit me through there. Bad. So I'm just gonna sit here at my little uh, murder hole and just kill these guys. So uh, I guess this is the end of episode two. Maybe I don't know. I'm kind of just recording these in bulk, cutting them up as I feel. So thank you for watching and have a nice day, everyone. And we're back. Um, so I'm level 16 now. Uh, it's still nighttime. I just decided to uh, show you this enchantment on this sword. Hope it's good. Um, I'm just going to go all out and do level 16 because if I die, I'm going to lose the levels anyway, or most of them, so. Yeah, that's not so good. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm going to get back to it, and I'll uh, talk to you guys when it's morning.